This section of the program will show you how to groom specific breeds. All of these styles shown are considered pet trims, not the required trim of the AKC, American Kennel Club. Please keep in mind, however, that in many cases, what we discuss about one breed may also be true for other breeds. For example, it is important that all breeds be carefully brushed, combed, bathed, and dried before grooming. This will ensure the best conditions for a successful grooming session. When grooming a Shih Tzu, you begin with the feet. Trim the hair between the pads of the feet using a close blade. Then clip the belly and rectum area very carefully. Using a number two attachment comb, start at the back of the skull about an inch or so behind the occiput. Clip down the back to the base of the tail. Scissor the feet round while combing the hair down on each foot. Keeping the scissors on the table, make a tight circle around each foot. The length of skirt is optional. It can be trimmed to just come off the floor or cut short for a cleaner, neater appearance. Head styles on the pet cut of the Shih Tzu can also vary. You can trim a circle, much like the Westie style, from the outside corner of one ear, down under the chin, and around to the back of the skull. Combing the hair forward on top of the head over the eyes, scissor from the outside corner of the left eye to outside corner of the right eye. Scissor the hair on the top of the head to about one inch. Trim the hair from the inside corners of the eyes going away from the eye. Do not clip down the top of the nose. This will look messy growing out as the hair will sprout straight up. The tail can be trimmed slightly at the tip or left natural. Clip the hair from the stomach and groin areas. This is what a well-groomed Shih Tzu looks like.